Shares of Roku jumped nearly 20% on Wednesday after the company announced that it had reached a new long-term deal with Google to keep YouTube on its streaming platform avoiding a looming deadline and ending months of messy negotiations. Effective today, we have agreed to a multi-year extension Why? This agreement represents a positive development for our shared customers, making both YouTube and YouTube TV available for all streamers on the Roku platform. With competition between streaming platforms more intense than ever, the long-term nature of the deal with Google presents big upside for. The company had originally gotten a big boost from stay-at-home customers during pandemic lockdowns last year. Roku's stock went on a tear in 2020 as the market rebounded from a low point in March, with shares rising more than 100%. This year has been a different story, however, pandemic favorite stocks have recently struggled amid the ongoing economic recovery as investors turn their attention to travel-related stocks like cruises and airlines. Roku shares are down 19% so far in 2021. That's how much Roku founder and CEO Anthony Wood is worth, according to Forbes estimates. His fortune is down from nearly $7 billion a year ago. Is the era of stay-at-home stocks over? Here's why Zoom, Pelotone and others have slumped in 2021, Forbes.